All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to Mall Wing and Replay Review Wars Advance Analysis. Just gotta keep spinning that around. Anyways, we're reviewing this game. Uh, Verdinos V2? It's me as Von Volt versus my opponent as Hawk. Uh, Von Volt gets plus 10 attack, plus 10 defense, and a super long power meter. Whereas Hawk gets plus 10 to attack and a bit of a smaller power meter. And kind of a better power, but we'll go over that later. Uh, if I did this right, I hope you all enjoy the green screened background, because I've been wanting to mess with some stuff. And if not, enjoy your hot pink background, because that's apparently the color I'm green screening, because that's the only color I can see to use. That would not disrupt other colors in the game. Woohoo! Yahoo! Yippee! Change country over to Grace Guy. I am the Grace Guy. Anyways, we're gonna begin with some infantry. Makes sense using your pre-deployed one to capture that it, that barracks. Does that make sense? I think this was like the match I wanted to focus on trying to make a unit every turn. Like no, like make sure like try to get my unit count up as high as possible when I was learning in the global league. I think I lose this one because I'm pretty sure this is before my first win. Nose, please. I'm sorry, I'm joining some aquatic ambience. Built two recons for the snow. I love that I just said, oh, I think this is the match where I'm like, oh, I want to focus on making sure my unit counts up higher. And then immediately base skip right after it because I am a friggin' moron. Oh, the Hawk's doing saving a lot of money, which isn't a bad option. I just kind of focused out on some recons early. Which probably isn't the best, but now our income's tied. Got three infantry out there to save up with some cash. Moving units up. It's kind of the standard capture thing. Not too bad. Capture, move out. Capture, move out and capture. Finish capturing and continue to move out. Moving my recons up into position, which... Really, I'm trying to think where I'd want my recons around for this. This isn't too bad. Hmm. That feels like too high of vision. <coughs> we'll see next turn, because, like, that seems off. I don't know if that's the Sonya HP stuff messing up. Then again, the Reaper viewers apparently have been having some problems lately. Oh yeah, the replay viewer is having some problems, okay. <laughs> yep, so that's gonna be fun. But yeah, the recon, getting his freak on. Oh no, this is vision, I'm stupid, that's attack range, duh. Oh yeah, I'm trying to think, like, maybe like, here would be a good spot to park if I could deploy a recon, get it over there for info, but that's gonna be very easy to get killed. Over here, maybe here in the corner wouldn't be a bad option, because I can grab info from one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Well, that doesn't really tell me anything. It tells me, like, this area. I don't know. See, this is, like I said, a good area, but it's very easy to get this recon killed. Now, here's a big difference. They have a battlecopter already out and about, ready to go. And I foolishly build a freaking tank. I guess this isn't the round I thought it was. I thought there was a round, like, I focused purely on just making sure my unit count is up as high as possible. Uh, capture rate, I am 2,000 behind, I, not really, because I have 2,000 going right there, I'm good. Actually, I'm way behind on the capture pang, it looks like. Yeah, I'm nowhere near my recon, they don't even have a transport, how did I mess this up so badly? I mean, my units are pretty well spread out, which ain't bad, but I guess it's also because I built recons when I should have been building more infantry. <laughs> well, tank and infantry, not bad. Sorry about the cough. Plus future when it decides to be a normal person and edit it out. Moving on up, checking around, building anti-air preemptively, because I'm like, there's gotta be battlecopters here. I just have a feeling, which Hey right feeling. This is ballsy. This is really freaking ballsy to like get that info. Oh hell yeah, it's Candy Kong song. Have y'all heard the Candy Kong song in in Junk in Barrel? Not Barrel Wise. Uh Swing can't no Jungle Climber that no swing again. King Swing. Ba -da -ba -da. Do, 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 do. 
Tekken sucks really good, but I really want to play some, I want to play some Tekken at some point. Uh, you're gonna really expect to see a bunch more of this unco- this, like, not normal commentary stuff, just kind of... Uh, what's it called? The post-commentary stuff for some video and matches soon, because I've been just getting upset in fighting games, so it's like, okay. Time to move over to post-commentary. I still don't have a battle copter. Are you kidding me, Winged? You're an absolute buffoon. A freaking menace. Get a freaking battle copter. There you go. Got a battle copter. Built another recon just to have it out and ready to go. I don't... Did my recon die? No, my recon's over deployed over here. Finally, finally capturing this, which... Can they see that? No, they can't see that, thankfully. Still doing capturing. And this is where I make a mistake. I come in here and just smack that recon, that infantry over there, which isn't a, great, a bad thing in idea. When did I take this guy out of the fucking forest? Why did I go after this kid? Oh, I did it because I wanted to interrupt the cap, but then I just threw away my, my freaking info. If I would have deployed myself right here and just sat here, no one would have seen me for a little while and I could have gathered up more intel. Oh well. Well, I'm seeing more mistakes already. Just foolishly going to interrupt a cap for no reason. Yeah, my recon over there is dead as a doornail. They have plenty of tanks. What if the tank counts? I have two versus three. I am behind on tanks. And I'm gonna definitely probably see more tanks here. And I'm getting behind in the capture game too, which really sucks. I've been I've been doing that a lot lately, just falling behind on capture rates, which makes me very sad because I've been bad about capturing more. He gets to interrupt my column tower, which really sucks. He's probably actually going to stop me from getting the communication tower. In general, tank anti-air recon. Makes sense. Go for a join cap, just to see what I can do. Deploy my infantry in the way. It's the harder, moving my little battalion on the left here. Not too bad. Hey, building a little, like, wall of infantry for no reason, because there's nothing behind it to protect. Rushing my recon in there. Probably going to throw it in danger any second now. Got a bow copter up there to help. Get over there to deter it, so tank, infantry, infantry, battlecopter. I am at the number, I think, because yeah, it's nine, seven, eight, nine, yeah. I'm at the number I want to be to keep getting to do tank, infantry. There goes my infantry, that really sucks. Okay, I'm also not really using Von Bolt's defense. Yeah, I'm super behind on the capture game, which really sucks. But again, I think this was a relatively newer game. I need to go scroll around on my thing to see how how far back this match was, because of this match, I think I'm just gonna be not a very good spot. Now the recons there are still getting info, which an actual tip I remembered learning recently is like if you can take out their eyes, take out their eyes. Go for the two for hey, we got a kill. We killed the tank. That's not bad. We actually have in okay position on the left here. We should dump more resources on the left, but I think I'm just gonna keep dumping resources over there on the right, which really sucks. But yeah, we're having a pretty decent push here on the left. We should probably focus in on that. But, unfortunately, because I'm still bad at this time of day, I'm pushing a lot more of my resources over to- I'm pushing a bunch of resources over to the right that I really shouldn't be. Because either side can be a strong side, weak side kind of thing, so it's just kind of like, eh. Yeah, he's building up a nice defense for his HQ. I'm going over there, doing some damage to my units. Killing, killing, killing. That's a three for her. This really sucks. Falling behind on unit count. Moving forward. Go oh, checking out the forest. Smart play. With their triple tanks all across the sky. Yeah, this ain't good. Recon or recon violence, not a very helpful thing. Go for the capture. Gun down the recon. Now, but they do know that I have an anti-air in there. Especially with all these recons and junk running around, and there's anti-airs over there I didn't even realize they had, but... I foolishly like, yeah, they probably don't have an anti-air. I don't know why. I built a transport copter out of what? Desperation? Jeezel. Two recons and a battle and a tank. Not terrible, but not good either. 
go over the kill, wait over there, move in to start capturing. Really dumb, they have a recon over there, but then again, I guess I didn't know that, but even then, still, they have plenty of stuff over there. Two infantry over there would be plenty enough to slow me down to the point they can get something better in to deal with me. How did you go down like that? Whatever, game. Take out my battlecopter, that sucks. Take out my recon, that sucks. Capturing more property. Oh look, that recon that was over there, even though we didn't even, they didn't really need the recon to like stop me. But they kind of already got the lead, so I'm kind of just playing behind. See, there goes my cap my my con tower capture. Do more damage to slow it down even more, and I think that they're really not killing the con tower. Well I guess if you weaken all the infantry around it, they can't capture as well, so it's kind of doing like the scorched earth strategy, but they're also winning. So this is just gonna become a win more kind of thing. Stop me on the properties, shoot me down. So I don't got a lot interesting to say right now. Let me get just like this is one of the older games where I definitely just kind of die. Bomber coming out, fair enough. Honestly, I might start skipping some of these earlier matches, and even then I am kind of skipping some of them around. Because I thought this was a match where it's like I never did any base skipping, like I always made like a copter if I could. And just kind of spammed out a bunch of battle copters. <coughs> and it's not bad to have... If, if I had this set up way earlier, and definitely knew what I knew now, I definitely would have focused on all my heavy vehicles in one side. Kind of a brawl going up here, which is kind of cool, but definitely not in the winning side of that. Well, yeah, no, but they're kind of just reinforcing real easy already. Yeah, there goes my good tank. So we're just really falling behind, and then they're also falling even more behind in the capture game. Oh, it hurts to see. Retreating his infantry back, go for the kill. See just how flucked this guy is with the three tanks. Just throw away this or this tank as well. We're just moving in there just to kill it. Just to get the kill on that thing, which was it what was it even I killed a recon? Are you shitting me, wing it? Uh, isn't even worth it really. Moving forward, shooting down their infantry capturing, just load out a little bit of their capture rate. But I don't know how much is that really gonna do. Triple tank across the sky. Let's go. Go over the swing on the tank. Ex Machina, where does it land? Bam. That push. Do I take advantage of this at all? I don't think I do. Yeah, especially because there comes a black storm. Ba -da -da -ba. Heal everything and then damage all my junk. So then I gotta pay this all back in repairs, which really sucks. Then I got a bomber hidden just out of you, which is really bad. Let's just watch these tanks get destroyed. Bam, bam, bam. Wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. I'm down to 18 units. This is terrible. They're starting to close in on my HQ, which really sucks. Neo tank and two tanks. Not bad. Vehicles moving up. Figure to take a shot at the infantry because I'm here. Recon on recon violence. I didn't even think about that being that. I took more damage back. Eight. Six. Yeah, I took three back while they did one well, unit two. That's unfortunate. Foolishly go after that. Move my transport up to move more units out. Move my infantry out of the way so now it's harder for me to interrupt. If they do go after my base, which I think they do. I think I lose by resigning though, if I remember correctly. Well, a couple little engagements there, not too bad. They got their bomber in there, which is kind of an issue for the tissue. And they're starting to surround the base. Yep. And then I think I just give up there because I know I, I can't do it. No, I foolishly still build stuff. I am actually crazy. And then they're just kind of doing the victory lap. And it was eliminated by capture. Very unfortunate. Uh, I only know what I was should have took away from this game. Not a whole lot. I just kind of made it. Oh, uh, what could I think? Definitely focus more on the strong side, weak side dynamic. Is I just like... Because I could put vehicles on my weak side and then move them over to my strong side later. But I just kind of kept pouring stuff in on my weak side that I didn't really need to be pouring. It was a losing battle. 
All right, then. Thank you all for watching. Goodbye.